Hey, welcome to Backwoods Gourmet. Today we got a box from the nice folks over at Camp Made, so we're going to unbox it and show you all the products that they sent us over to check out. Y'all stay tuned. <music> First thing we're going to do is just uh, see what all they sent. Uh, it's great, folks. I guess uh, watch our channel there, and um, you know, we're watching a lot of our Dutch oven and cast iron stuff. And wow, this this box is packed. So let's start pulling it out of here. That's the first thing I grab. It's the uh, can't made small skillet bag for six and a half inch skillets. Uh, we'll try that out for you today. We'll see how that works. Okay, some of these things we're not all going to be able to do today. Here we have the uh, Camp Made kickstand and Dutch oven lifter. Uh, we might try that out today too. Alright, here we have the uh, Camp Made Dutch oven solutions flip grill uh, lid holder accessory. And uh, I believe this is for one of the other items in the box. So here they have uh, also sent some of their little fuel starters. I'm not big on these, they're probably paraffin, but uh, maybe we'll try it out. Right, the next thing they sent us is charcoal and wood holder. This would be a great thing for when, you, uh, when you're day tripping like we do a lot and you, and you can't find a place where you can really put your charcoals down, there's no grill or anything, you can actually put this uh, right on the ground and it'll hold your ashes and your charcoal so we'll probably save this one for our next day trip and try that one out all right here's another one product i'm really excited about this is the uh camp made collapsible and portable charcoal chimney uh definitely you know i, I always have to pack up my big weber when we go day trip or uh you know over to over to the beach or whatever this one actually folds down i can't wait to try this one out Oh, big bag. They also sent us some of their uh, coconut charcoal barbecue briquettes made from from coconut bark. So we got a uh, we ha actually have a upcoming video on uh, co comparisons with different kind of charcoal, and this will definitely be in that comparison. So uh, look forward to seeing this uh, future video. Uh, once we do that video, I'll. Uh, Throw it up there on, on at the end on end screen. You can click on that and go over to there and see how that all turned out. Yeah, this box just keeps giving. And, uh, here we go. Here's the Dutch oven lid holder and lid lifter combo. Um, I actually had one of these before that my wife had bought me for Christmas. It worked pretty well. Uh, I did leave it out in the rain and it got a little rusted and uh, I ended up breaking one of the legs off of so now we have a replacement I'll show you some really cool things you can do with this and it does come in handy especially when you're out uh, away from you know a normal place where you have a good cooking surface you have at least a place to put your your lid down and when you lift that lid up it actually keeps it up off the ground we'll show you that one on a future episode also because there's a there's a million different things you can do with this camp made tool all right, let's see if we got anything else. That's it. So uh, we'll get right into checking out a few of these products. Okay, the first thing we're going to check out, I just took this, this off the card here. It's got a couple of zip ties on it, and it does require a little bit of assembly, it looks like, uh, at least for its kickstand version. And you see it has a, uh, a spring pin here, and then this piece is separate, but there's a hole here for that to snap right into. So you just do it just like that. Okay, and if we go and look at the picture on the on the page here, it uh, shows your lid hanging on the back side of it like that. So let's see how that works. Okay, so here's our small camp made eight inch Dutch oven. We we love this thing, especially for doing small dishes and and uh, side dishes. You just take the unit and just hook it on the lid like that, and you can set it right down, and it holds your lid perfect, just like that. So, so that would be quite handy for uh, 
you know, turning your lids. Um, it's got kind of a little gripper area right there. And what I kind of like about this is that kind of, you know, it breaks down. Up that pin up, slide this back on, and it makes a much uh, smaller package to pack. Here's the uh, Camp Made skillet bag. Go ahead and get this out of the out of the pack here real quick. You know, I love our uh, I love our Dutch oven bags we have, and you know, usually I stuff a skillet into the one of the Dutch oven bags that's in there banging against the bag there so it's got a zipper just on one side so let's grab one of our pans off the wall here and see how it works so here's one of my phase my, one of my my number six uh, antique three-notch lodge one of my beautiful uh, finds in the um, antique store that fits in there just perfect but actually that'll fit a much bigger pan let's try a bigger so one. here's our uh, recent find Mrs. Backwoods did a great job with this one. This old Wagner, uh, Wagner, it is smooth as baby's butt, and uh, I haven't done anything to it except for just continue reseasoning it, seasoning it, uh, building on the seasoning that was there. As you can see, that fits in there perfect. Hey, it's even got a little loop you can hang it up. That's going to come in handy. So last but not least, we're going to go ahead and unbox the lid holder. Let me show you that uh, real quick. This is uh, something that is a multi-use multi item, actually. Let's see if we could get it out of the box here. Let's take a look at it. So it comes pretty well packed. It's, it's jammed in there well. And when you first pull this out, you're going to go, what kind of a contraption is this? But once you look at it a little more closely um, and actually my first one didn't come with these parts now has uh, little legs little feet for your legs so go ahead and, um, I'll show you real quick you just fold this out just like that and you can adjust this to different size pots we'll start it out upside down show you how to put this together uh, these just they just push on to the uh, on the end of the legs there. Now you're going to want to remove these if you're going to put this over any kind of heat. <laughs> All right, get rid of this bag. I'll show you how it lifts the lid on the Camp Made Dutch oven. Okay, so I'll show you how you lift your lid with this guy. You move these little feet in to whatever size Dutch oven you got. Here we got to push pretty far in because that is the, uh, the smallest Dutch oven. Then you push this spring down at the top till your lid hooks and it holds your lid perfectly. Plus, now you can set it right down on the ground, um, you know, to, to keep it uh, off the ground and keep it clean while you're doing your dish. Put it right back on top of the Dutch oven. Press down, unhook it, lift it off. There's also a million other combinations of the way you can use this product, and we'll get to those in time. Now, if you're like me and you prefer the good old fashioned tool, it also makes a great place to put your lid when you're cooking. So, there you are some handy items from Camp Made. And we're going to enjoy trying each one of these out. I can tell you right now, I'm already digging that skillet bag right there. So I'll leave you a link where you can go find these great products right down in the description box. Hey, don't forget to check out our Amazon store, but I'll leave you the link in the very first comment down below. You can go to the Backwoods Gourmet store and buy all kinds of cast iron, outdoor cooking, grilling, and Dutch oven supplies right there on our store. Remember, if you don't see what you want, just use that search bar to buy anything on Amazon.
Thanks for watching the Backwoods Gourmet. As always, please subscribe, share, comment. Hey, if you like what we're doing, hit that like button. If you'd like to subscribe to our channel, you can do it right here. To see another great Backwoods Gourmet video, it's going to be right up here. And for a whole playlist, cast iron and Dutch oven cooking, it's going to be right up there. We'll see you next time.